Doma Sports Talk Worldwide with some news from the world of boxing. So y'all know what time it is. You ain't in a rush to get concussed. Well, good news in the world of boxing, y'all. You know, good news. Sanction bodies seem to finally do their job, I guess. You know what I'm saying? In the 168-pound division, you know, Canelo Alvarez is the undisputed champion, right? But hey, he's not kind of, you know, doing what an undisputed champion he is. You know, you're going to have those four belts, so you're going to have to, you know, you know, have to defend them at some point. So we know in the WBC, Canelo hasn't defended versus uh, David Benavides. Everybody's talking about David Benavides. He hasn't defended David Benavides, and we were supposed to get some information in March to what's going to happen to Canelo and the WBC. Well, the WBC has stripped. Canelo Alvarez of the title. And that's okay. So, you know, uh, Dave Benavidez is going to fight against somebody vacant. And, hey, that's what it's supposed to do. So, I don't know what, what's going to happen with Dave Benavidez's fight against Gorchik at 175 pounds. But, as of right now, Dave Benavidez is really, he's the interim champion now. Canelo is going to be fighting Munguia on March the, um, uh, May the 4th. So, now... Uh, Dave Benavides fights somebody to become the WBC champion. I think he should do that before going up to 175 and trying to come back down. Finally, WBC did something to show us that Mar Mar uh, Mauricio Sullivan is human after all. You know, because I was, if he would have came around me, I would have tried to wipe the ashes off of him. Because I kind of thought he came from somewhere where it's a lot of, you know, fire and ashes and brimstone and stuff like that. So, hey, cool. You know, finally he's done what he's supposed to do. Now, the WBA. Right? The ones who wanted to consolidate their belts because, you know, they got all these regular champions. Remember that? You know, they got a champion, then you have one or another one called regular champion. Right? Just made up some stuff to get more sanctioning fees and, you know, confuse us, the fans. Right? So, you know, the last two years, like, they've been on a crusade to make sure that we only got one champion per division, like it's supposed to be. Right? So we're just basically going back to what's, what's supposed to be. And they were doing it in every division except for... The 168-pound division where Canelo has the WBA belt. And the, they have the very best WBA regular champion of all time with another Cuban together. And that would be Guillermo Rigondeaux. He was also regular at one point. Right? So, well, Manny Pacquiao was a regular one too. But this guy's up there. And that's David Morrell. Matter of fact, David Morrell's so good that I don't even think uh, Benavidez want to mess with him unless it's very significant. Right? If it's for Undisputed, I think Devin Benavidez will mess with him. Or like Three Belt Unified, maybe. Okay. But not for just for Peanuts. You know, similar to Terrence Crawford and Boots Endless. You know. So anyway, the WBA has come out and said, hey, we're stripping Canelo. Canelo stripped of the WBA title. So he's going into that fight with two belts. And hey, Dave Morrell is going to fight for the for the real title and it's going to someone vacant. What they probably should do is just say Dave Morrell versus Dave Benavidez for both titles. That's probably what they should do. Who knows what's going to happen going forward. But the bottom line is we've hit planet Earth again. I'm glad I'm, that we're not somewhere else because I was thinking, you know, justice is just, you know, people can't stand justice. Canelo has had both of the belts way too long. You know, you can do what you want to do now. No one, you were undisputed, which Canelo got, the WBC gave him that belt anyway. He didn't really earn it, right? They gave it to him when he was fighting for the WBA against Callum Smith. WBC just said, hey, here, take this one as well. You know, and I didn't think that was fair either because we're going to call him undisputed. And the other people that gets undisputed titles fight for all four belts, right? Canelo just fought for three of them, right? But okay, whatever. People probably think that's okay too. I don't know why. You know, just you say anything that's fair and something's wrong. People don't like fairness, you know? So we'll have issues with a guy like me. But anyway, the WBA and the WBC have come out and said, we stripping Canelo Alvarez. That's it. It's been long enough. So it's a glorious day. But here, check the date. Doma Sports Talk Worldwide. And I'm out of here, y'all.